Okay, um, I actually had a nice power outage here, so, uh, I was in the middle of recording another video, and then the video became worthless, because, uh, if you shut the power ops and you're recording with fraps, the video kind of breaks, and you can't really recover it, unfortunately. So, anyway, um, I did a little backtracking, I hope I'm in the right place that I was, but, uh, anyway, the, the, what I was going to do is we were going to raise our reputation, I guess, to, um, to 18. Let's go ahead and do that. Don't it's a little expensive, me. but that's okay. I'm super important. Let's see, first of all, <clears throat> I guess I did this uh, the last video, but uh, like I said, I lost the freaking video because of a freaking uh, crash. Let's go ahead and let's go ahead and sell. I don't think it matters. Your a reputation doesn't task. matter for selling; it only matters for buying. Oh, and oh, I forgot I'm to rest. Doing. Let's go do that real quick for, before I raise my reputation. We need to rest. So we'll go rest in, uh, Dom and Dom. go rest in Baragoth here real quick. Yeah, this is what I forgot to do. Uh, nice little, yeah, just nice little, um, random power outage. It didn't even stay off for more than a second. It just had to, had Dom to shut my computer down. That was what it needed to do. Whiskey. Okay, let's go ahead and do this again. I think we did this, right? Yeah. Yeah, of course we did this. Tonight there it is. Okay, got that done. Let me see if I can sell this guy anything. I, got some cheap beer for ya. I can sell him that. Oh, yeah, okay. I can sell him the Bracers of Death. I'm not going to be using that for sure. Did he have anything that I wanted? Yeah, it's a composite longbow, but I don't need that. He has some spells, but I don't think I'm actually going to be using any spells. I was thinking of maybe hiring a mage at some point, but I don't think I'm going to bother with that. <clears throat> so we're just going to go back. Uh, I forgot to identify the boots of speed. That's okay. Uh, you don't actually ever need to identify those if you don't want to. I am going to identify those, though. Done and done. All right, but anyway, we're gonna raise our reputation to 18. I figure we could we could get it to 20 without raising it to 18 <laughs> right now, me. but I'm, I'm impatient important. and I've got the money to burn. Okay, let's get those on right now. Let's go ahead and save just in case Don't we screw up. Me. Okay, I'm inner donation. Important. Right now it should be 200. Okay, then we go 300. Then we go 500. And after 500, it's 800. <clears throat> then after 800, I figure it's a, yeah, it's a thousand. And after a thousand, it's 1500. And after 1500, it's 2000. And after 2000, it's 2500. Then it's 5000 for the last one. Let's see if we got it. Yep, okay, we're there. And we still have a fair amount of money. We have 1300, uh, or 13,864. So we no longer need to worry about this. And let's save it. Uh, <clears throat> oh. Don't touch me. I'm gonna buy a few potions off him. Important. And a couple more elixirs couple of antidotes because they like poisoning me in this game. Actually, let's take out the antidotes. I do like having some bags of holding in, in the original Baldur's Gate 1. That was added with the expansion, oh, or the uh, enhanced no. edition. Okay, so, so we go to Baldur's Gate now. Friendly arm in. I'm going to skip that. There's Don't a few things you could do there. Done. Oh, I know what I did. Okay. There's there's a quest. Am I really... I'm not in the shadows. What am I, what am I kidding there? 
Doesn't look like I'm in the shadows. Where am I here? I'm in the wrong spot. That's why. Okay, now I'm in the shadows. Pretty darn sure that's the case now. Okay, here's where I'm going. I'm going in here really quickly. There's a little quest I can do. And uh, there's some items, actually. Some halfway decent items, in fact. So I didn't do this before, kind of because I couldn't get through here without really taking some risks. It's a little bit easier now that I've got a very high stealth. That's a pretty good potion right there. And it looks like we're going to have to drop something. Probably don't need... It's char That's dire charm, actually. I think it'll sell for a little something. This, this can go. Oh, really? I'm... Oh, really? Seriously? Oh, I think I know why. Um... Yeah, yeah, I should have sold that. That's the problem. Doggone it. I'm gonna just... I'm gonna just freaking walk right out. There we go. Yeah, I'm gonna walk right out encumbered. I don't care. <clears throat> uh, we got the boots of speed, so it isn't quite as bad as it would be. Simple task. Yeah, there's a farmer over here that wants me to bring his, corp his son's dead corpse. Please, won't no one help me? It will be hard going without my son. Okay, cool. I uh, want to get in the shadows here because... Oh, crap, never mind. Yeah, you can get Ankeg, Ankeg plate mail if you kill one of these guys and bring their husks to the blacksmith. It used to be a really, really good thing to get for an archer, but they kind of fixed it, so now we're... Ouch. So now you can't use it on an archer, but it used to be the best armor for an archer, I think. Yeah, pretty much. But they fixed that, quote-unquote fixed that. I don't know if I'd consider that really fixed. It's not metal armor, for crying out loud. Let me see. Cannot use... Oh, no, they changed it not... Cannot wear, wear metal armor to can only wear leather studded and hide armor. Yeah, so I guess that fits now, now that they changed that. Still, I say that's bunk. You have been waylaid Dog. by enemies and Dog. must defend yourself. Doggies. Of course. <laughs> yeah. That's actually pretty hefty, that weight. Yeah, I don't know if I really want to be lugging that around. Drop it. I'm not going to turn it into, uh, well, I was thinking about it. That's not going to help me. That's habit. I really like, uh, really like using that armor, if I can. It's pretty good armor, but... I serve the flaming fist! Citizens, please step forward. Okay, I didn't know if you, to tell him uh, the whole story, you needed this stuff or not, so I guess maybe, maybe not, but I kept it anyway, just in case. I always, that's why I always keep those, uh, those, um, scrolls there. Uh, this guy's not useful, so we're gonna skip him. Cue crappy redone cutscene. Look at how crappy that is, man. Oh, thou wanderer. Stay thy course a moment to indulge an old man. Get out of here, old man. Of course. <laughs> yeah. Right off the bat, we go in here. Hi, friend. 
and we take something out of, of a course. barrel. <laughs> yeah. Of course. Take care of this right here, and then that's pretty much. Does this lady, does this lady have anything I want right now? Oh no. Oh yes, she does. I'm gonna need a couple of those. By a couple, I mean four of them. There's some other stuff I'd like to buy. Actually, let's buy the the speed potions real quick. I think we'll be using those speed potions. We'll just drop them in here. Yeah, we'll be using one. No more moving slow. No more waiting. Move as fast as we want right now. Yeah, we want to go in here. Yes. See what you have. Let's go ahead and identify this. This guy is the best merchant in the game, basically. He identifies everything, buys pretty much everything, and I think sells just about everything, too. And uh, we probably want to put the potions of speed right here. And we're going to want to sell a bunch of this yes. junk here. Um, I don't think I'm going to use any of this on second thought, so we're just going to sell it. Dire Charm, Ghost Armor, I don't think so. The rest of this stuff I'll keep. And uh, he has some pretty nice stuff. Arrow of Biting, Arrow of Detonation. Yes, we'll get those eventually, but not right now. Bolt of Lightning. These are extremely cheap. I'm going to get a whole stack of these. Um, he also has, I think, a few potions and yeah, visibility. I'm going to just grab one of those real quick. I might come in handy. Put that in there. This goes right here, I guess. I'm going to be using these from now on. This is pretty nice. I mean, in addition to your regular crossbow damage, you get... Uh, 44 of electro electrical damage with no save. If they save, it's half. So, plus, uh, basically plus uh, 2 to 8 if they save, or 4 to 16 if they don't save. That's pretty good damage. I mean, wow. Crossbows aren't as bad as you might think. Okay, so we've got to go hire a thief because there's a couple of places that we're going to need him real quick to make things easier. Plus, I'm not allowed to kill anybody right now, or my reputation drops. One is not so, to walk in the steps of their father. Um, I believe I'm going to have to get him to steal an item that I would only otherwise be able to get if I could kill somebody. But I'm not going to be killing anybody for a little oh, while, because <laughs> I can't afford the reputation drop. Because we want a high reputation to get better... Um, uh, better prices in shops because I'm going to be buying a bunch of stuff for the last fight. Yo, he would speak at you, but tis destined to be so. Uh, this guy Who actually dares prod has a... Whoops, he didn't get his level up. There he is. This guy has a small cameo in Baldur's Gate 2, but um, it's uh, it's pretty brief. But he's kind of a fun character. He's a cleric thief, which is pretty nice. <clears throat> yes. All right, dude, I'm even going to go as far as to actually give him a potion of haste because otherwise he's going to be too slow. Cool, that way he can kind of keep up. Can I go out this way? No, I don't think I can, so let's go back there. Hello there. Hello there. To you two. So we gotta go up, steal a book, then we gotta open a few doors with this guy. It's not that I couldn't just bash them open, but it's a little bit easier since Don't while I have him. Oh, that's right, I can't go this way. While I have this guy, I go ahead and use him to open some doors task. that are kind of difficult to open. A simple <clears throat> task.
But first things first, we go steal something off somebody. I love money. Yes, I do. Of course. <laughs> Tx hears you. All right, Tx, you're gonna be doing a little thievery. I think you should only need two of these to pull it off. Soon, Tx rules. I believe no matter how high your pickpockets is, there's at least a 1% chance to fail. So, we're going to save first. Got it. First try. This way, good sir. Over here. Whoops. Forgive me, but I have meditations to attend to. Identify it and use it immediately. Plus one wisdom. So I've now got 15 wisdom. Uh, for whatever that's worth, not really much. Doesn't add any extra spells for the ranger, so... Uh, like I said, I thought that there was a slight bonus to, like, spell reaction, but I don't know if that was actually implemented. Okay, there's really quickly something we need to do in here. We need to kill this guy. <laughs> One shot. All right. Um, I'm, it reminds me I got to turn this guy's uh, script off because he's going to run up and do things I don't want him to do. of course. I don't think this mage robe is worth... Is this worth using, keeping? I don't think so. I think it's these two items I want. Destiny or no... I don't actually get a plus one rep for that, which is a, a kind of a shame. Okay, let's go ahead and save. Up here we go. And... Let me think here. What's up here? I think there's... The helm of... Helm or the... No, there's the... There's the helm of the Balderon over here. It's in a place called... Helm and Cloak, right there. Okay, good. Of course. <laughs> yeah. Whoops, I don't want to talk to that guy. A simple test. Okay, actually, we want so him back here. Well, oh. task. here. I'm going to take a little fire damage, but it doesn't really matter. Or let me see. Task. Maybe I can... No, nah, I can't outrun it. Oh, well, uh... <laughs> Whoops. What now? I want a simple task. Oh well. So we got the helm of the boulder on there. Oh this gives you charm creature. Well this is interesting because um I thought it was uh what was what was his name? Neener's cloak? Was it Neener's cloak? This looks like the same exact thing. This might actually come in handy. I'm gonna put it on. All right. Now you're supposed to find that Helm of the Balderon through a huge involved quest where you go looking everywhere, but if you know where it is beforehand, you don't need to do that. I just kind of just went in there and took it anyway. Um, where is that? I need, need to get a little healing, so where is the uh, temple? There it is. The vigilant one knows of all your sins. All right, we're gonna get some healing real quick. Is that it? What do you got? I'll pick up a few more of these because I'm kind of greedy. Not sure how many of these you can get away with stacking. Well, apparently unlimited, looks like. Oh, um, the dude. The one knows of all your sins. I got some stuff you need to identify. Thank you very much. Helm of the Balderon. So, in uh, Baldur's Gate 1, this is a pretty nice helm. Plus one Thaco, plus one armor, armor class, saving throws. All those are pretty amazing in Baldur's Gate 1. In Baldur's Gate 2, it's pretty much uh, not even worth using. Yes. 
<laughs> except for tough. except for um, the first part of the game, but in the latter half of the game, there are much more useful helmets. And uh, you know the um, the th the saving throw bonus and the Thaco bonus in particular isn't as amazing in Baldur's Gate 2. Okay, so this guy is going to have to open this door. Let's go ahead and save. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He usually, or he used to hit you with a lightning bolt, but I guess he doesn't do that anymore. What the freaking no way. Oh my god, really? I don't believe that happened. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to equip the Spider's Bane so that doesn't happen again. A simple task. Okay. Of course. <laughs> done and done. I guess one of these guys somehow hit me, and I can't even believe task. that happened. A simple task. Okay. Yes. Time to uh, totally destroy this guy. Who dares prod Tiax, you need to open this because this is actually it's actually very hard to open otherwise. And I just got a level. Still need to grab something, I think, from over here. Oh, no, it's over here. There it is. And that's it. That's all we need. Oh, my God. Am I going to be able to get out of here? Oh, I got diseased. Oh, so those guys did hit me. Oh, crap. Okay, Alright, good. So, got away with getting diseased, which is actually kind of sucks. I don't have anything to cure that right now. Oh, yeah, duh. yeah, I do. Alexa. Okay, good. I should have had that, that sword on, because that guy had a chance to actually paralyze me. Okay, Tiax, you wait out here. I'm gonna kill this ogre in here. Of course. This guy's gonna attack me. He's gonna die pretty quick though. Oh, I just wait around forever, don't I? Don't have enough to tax per turn, I guess. Oh no, you don't wanna do that. Oh, come on. Hey, why isn't disease cured? Disease should have been cured when I drank that potion. It's got a lot of rings, huh? Yeah, I drank the potion, but it didn't cure disease. Interesting. So, I guess that's a bug. Okay, there's one more thing I need this guy for. Come on. Of course. <laughs> yeah. Hello, mate. You look a friendly face. Quiet. <sighs> Take my money. Of course. <laughs> yeah. Um, and that's for the cloak of the Balderon, and I don't know why this lady oh, has it. There's Prod TX. But TX is I guess there's does. <laughs> some sort of justification for her actually having it in the storyline. This is... Ah, well. Alright, and that's really all we need TX for. Because we're not going to do any more stealing that I can think of. So we're going to go... I'm going to go get cured. I'm going to go over here really quickly. TX is going to stay here. I believe this is the only temple here anyway, so... I'm gonna really quickly go get cured of disease. A simple the vigilant one knows of all your sins. Wow, how did I how did I not cure that before? Wait a minute, dude. You don't have cure disease? How am I supposed to get cured of this crap? This is bull crap. I don't believe it, dude. Well let me let me try another potion. Try another Lexer potion. Maybe that'll do it.
either that's a bug, either that's a dis oh, it's nauseated. Okay, well, maybe that wears off. I don't know. Helm sees all. Know that and be judged. I got a lot of stuff to identify. Okay, Cloak of the Balderon. This is the best cloak in the game, including Baldur's Gate 2, by the way. Unfortunately, you cannot actually import it into Baldur's Gate 2 that I know of. No, actually, you can't. Which sucks. Wand of Paralyzation, that's pretty good. I think this is an area of effect. Yeah, it's an area of effect. This is actually really good. It's a really good thing to have. So let me go ahead and use this real quick. This is uh, ups my intellect. Okay, so I now have 16 intelligence, which means three hits from mind flayers. Um, I can withstand three hits from mind flayers. And there's a plus two ring right there. I'm going to swap out for my old ring. Uh, that's not useful. That's not useful. It's Knave's robe. Actually, that wasn't even worth identifying. That's not useful. Okay. Um. Cool. So I'm I'm now. Yeah, we we got the helmet of the boulder in. Okay. What what's my Thaco actually? I have three attacks per round, and. My Thaco is six. I thought it should be lower. Interesting. Oh, it's because I'm not using the plus one bolts. That's why. Thaco is five with those. Well, that's okay. Thaco is six is pretty good. Oh, yes, and I have a another level to get to. I have another level up waiting for me. Drops my Thaco. Oh, right. I've been getting nice level ups with my hit points. Drops my Thaco by another one. So my Thaco should now be five. Oh, and I got another attack per round, or another half attack per round, probably. Somehow. Yeah, because I reach seven, I get another half attack per round. And that's as far as I'm going as far as levels. And my Thaco's five, and that's freaking awesome. So I could probably kill Drizzt now. But uh, we're going to wait, because we want to do a bunch of buying with a high reputation. That's definitely going to tank my reputation. Actually, what does this guy have? He still has this stuff that needs to be identified. I think this is protection from magic, so that's a free protection from magic scroll right there. And we're going to ditch this guy. Uh, protection from poison, don't really need. Protection from acid... I don't know. I'm thinking I could maybe be able to sell that, maybe. Yeah, we'll see. Anyway, he, he gets ditched now. We don't need him anymore. TX hears you. Goodbye, TX. Yeah, cool. See you in Baldur's uh, Gate 2. Task. In an insane done asylum. Done. All right, so now we go back here. We gotta talk to this guy. Don. Yes. Don. Um. Hmm. I thought he he um. Once you have the nymphs lock of hair or whatever, I thought he gives you something for that. Maybe I never got that. Interesting. They must have changed that. Protection from poison. Sell that. Curls. Curse scroll of. Clumsiness, I don't care about that. Uh, I don't care about this. Um, don't care about this, this, this. I think I'll keep that around. Don't care about this. Don't care about this. I've got two wands of paralyzation, really? Be damned. Let me sell one of them and see if I can buy back with more charges. Wait a minute, it says I can't use it. That's weird. What? Okay. Wait a minute. I can use this, can't I? Maybe I can't use it. I can't use it. Okay, never mind. So, um... Yes? <laughs> Alright, so let's sell it then. I thought I could use those somehow. Uh, scroll of Clumsiness. What does that actually do? I think it drops your stats or something. 
Okay, but um, got a got a fair amount of gold. Uh, let's see here. Oh yeah, we want to probably see what else he has for sale. And uh, let's see here. Oh yeah, I tell you, there's two things we need for sure. We need protection from fire. And we can no, we don't want to do protection from magic because that'll drop our our haste. Um, do we have potion of fire? Was it fire breathing? Mind focusing. We're gonna need that. We don't need this stuff right now. This is for the last battle, so we're gonna skip it. Potions of explosions. Oil of speed. Let's go ahead and get some more oils of speed. I'm going to need that for now. Potion of invulnerability. Okay, I don't need that stuff. I need it eventually, but not right now. Bolt plus two. I believe we have some bolts plus two. We bolts of biting. Although I'm sure Drizzt will will not be affected by that. I'm almost positive. Bolts of lightning. Okay, that's for for now. I think that's okay. Um, Yeah. It's bolt. No, this is bolt plus one. It's not bolt plus two. So many things I'm going to be needing to buy at some point. Drop that in there. Might be able to just sell some of this stuff. Yeah, let me sell some of these scrolls. Yes. Because I'm going to solo it for the last battle, so I'm pretty sure I can do it. I've got good enough Thaco. I'm going to have good enough items. So we can recover a little bit of our money by just selling some of these scrolls that we're not going to be using. Oh, I've got two protection from fire scrolls. Awesome. Okay, that's perfect. That's exactly yes. what I need. Okay, and we yes. want to get this. We want to get... Arrow of Detonation, we're going to have 20 of those. It's going to cost us a little bit, but that's okay. Now, let's see. I'm going to... Should I get rid of this? No, I don't have Warhammer specialty either. So, let's go ahead and... Um, I'll keep the Spider's Bane. I'm going to sell this yes. to make room. And uh, I'm going to have to pick up a short bow somewhere. Yeah, we'll run across the bow or short bow at some point, I'm sure. Uh, oh, yeah, we can uh, we can go up here and kill these guys for uh, no reputation hit. A simple toss. Pretty sure if we just do the right dialogue. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute, this is the wrong thing. Nice. Look at how quickly that destroys them. That's awesome. All right, this is cursed, I think. This is this is sellable. Saleable. This I think is saleable. I don't know what this is, but I'll take it and try and sell it. Done and done. Stupid yes. people calling me. My God, I'm gonna ignore it. Okay, I can't use this, nor that annoying phone in the background. Okay, I made a little money there. Uh, looks like my haste wore off, so we're going to be drinking another one. And oh, Iron cool. Throne, I think, is next. Dang it. I'm going to have to quit. Oh, man. 
man. Okay. Done and done. Yeah, I had to answer the phone. They just kept calling, kept calling, and kept calling. All right, so we go into the Iron Throne, and uh, yeah, we're skipping some storyline, by the way. Yeah. Hey, yeah. Hey, yeah. Goodbye. And there's this guy. And there's this guy. Of course. Yeah. All right, so quick save. Um, this could be a little iffy. Think about what I need here. I might go ahead and try and poison someone right off the bat. A simple task. Oh, good. They're all bunched up. <laughs> Okay, and uh, right off the bat, we're going to make use of horror. And then we're going to see if we can poison this bastard. What happened? Did I just screw that up? Seems like I just screwed that up. Poisoned it. Oh, what the heck? How'd you get me? Oh, magic resistance. Ha ha. All right, so um, I'm gonna switch back to these and we're gonna get rid of this guy right here. Wow, did you see how fast that killed that guy? Holy crap. Are you still casting? Holy crap. Well, let's not stand there then. Archer owns so, so bad, man. So good. Die. Done and done. Done and done. I think I'll take this crap. I think I can use this this item actually. I'm going to uh, quaff this potion of giant strength so I can carry all my loot that I'm going to get from these guys. Ouch. Didn't hit him? How am I not hitting this guy? Oh, there we go. Okay, I'm gonna try and uh, cast cast horror again. Got one. Of course. And this guy. I don't think so, bro. Got another one. Potion of fire breath. Ooh. I don't really need that though. I'll take I'll take the rest of it. Or oil of fiery burning. I'm sorry. Might come in handy. Doesn't cost anything to carry it. What? Wait a minute. Who's? Holy crap! What are you doing here? Okay. I'm going to say forget about that guys nice and vulnerable so I'm gonna take advantage let's see how oh, you little trick here die simple task okay that's a bunch more down let's see I don't need that so I'll take this and I guess I'll take this because there's I need some kind of proof that these guys are up to no good Okay. Minor sequencer. Nice. I'll take that. It's sellable, I think. I believe I can just put that in there and it'll still count. Die. I didn't lose any rep, did I? Good. Who is this? Is this anybody I have to kill? Oh, I think it is. Yeah, the, that guy I have to kill. These guys aren't aren't enemies per se. This other guy is. Did he go up the stairs or something? I think he went up the stairs. There he is. Got to be thorough. Want to kill this guy too? 
Yeah, get some protection from undead. Nice. And some pretty good spells and something here I can sell. Fireball. I believe this is protection from undead. More spells that I can sell. I'm going to go down here because... I think I'm supposed to talk to this guy. Hello. I don't want any trouble. All right, whatever. This is the real emissary Tar that was whose identity was stolen by the doppelganger. All right, I think this is it. So we're just gonna go run out now. First of all, I'm gonna have these items identified done and, done. and sold. Oh, what am I doing? Well, of course, I it you. Well, of I course, it you. A simple task. Hey. I serve the flaming fist. Okay, so that's part of the storyline, but first I've got a ton of items weighing me down here that I'm gonna go done get rid of. And done. A simple right. task. Talk to so and so here. I believe that scroll is protection from undead, which is about to become useful. Mace plus one. Um, no. Wand of Heavens. Uh, I can't use that. Why can't I use that? Not usable by really. Thought I could use that. Warhammer. This is uh this is interesting, but I'm selling it. Wand of Lightning. I'm selling it because I can't use it. This is the ring of Ways me out. I don't want that because I've got a I've got a sword that does that. Okay, so all that crap. Can't open the scroll case and sell stuff directly out of it, unfortunately. I still didn't manage to get myself a bow. However, I think I know where I can get one before I'm going to need it. I'm going to want a bow before I go to Candlekeep or right after, and I think I can just get one from, um, uh, what's his face? Don the innkeeper. Don uh, or is that a, there's, there's a weapon shop over here, isn't there? Maybe not. It's, there's probably is, but I can't look for it right now. All right, so we're going to go back and keep going for the storyline. Let me actually check and see what I've done so far. Okay, so we've got the intelligence. We've got the constitution boost, dexterity boost. We need the strength boost, charisma boost, and the wisdom boost times two. Okay. It's fine. Done and done. We're going over here and completing everything else. Well, of course. <laughs> yeah. We got to go in here really quickly. A simple task, yes. A simple task. Look at how easy those guys are with this thing. Come to torment me some more, you shape-shifting bastards. Okay, there's actually, I believe, yep, there's a weapon over here. There's something over there, but I can't get in because it's locked. Done. Yes. Done. A simple task. Okay, I think... I think that I should be getting my plus two reputation somewhere over here, I think. I am a man of my word. Okay, I skipped that part. I am a man of my word. Go for the audience with the Grand Duke. I am a man of my word. 
And I've already actually done this, so we oh, just come back to him and say... I am Duke Elton. Did I get plus one reputation? Journey has come f Son of a gun, I didn't get anything for reputation. Don Rex. Don Hold, travelers! Before you will be allowed entrance, you must... Okay, so we're just going to go do Candlekeep real quick then. Uh, first things first, I got to get healed. Finally, that disease thing wore off. Yeah, we're going to go talk to this These guy. These walls contain the world's knowledge. Always used to freak me out a little bit about Candlekeep, how there's all these doppelgangers running around and nobody's nobody really realizes it. A simple task. Okay, so we're gonna go My talk to him. as clean as an elven arse. Okay, he definitely sells something. Bows, short bow, long bow, doesn't matter. I'll just get a composite long bow. Okay, now I can throw these de arrows of detonation. Not yet. We don't need them yet, but, you know, when we do need them. In fact, I'll go ahead and rest over here. My hotel's as clean as an elf. Wait, it doesn't ours. matter. We're gonna rest later. Of course. There's no fighting um, for a little while here, so we don't need to be fully healed or anything like that. We've just got a basically a bunch of sequences to go through. Salutations. And this I guy, I'm going to board him because he wants to talk to me. Like yourself. Crap! Where's Let me you in. Know? Of course. <laughs> yeah. Don and. Doing something on your mind? These walls. Our library. Don't you need I'm something stranger. And I am going to be as rude as possible. Um, this guy, Kovaras, is actually Saravak, but um, he's undercover right now. And you can get a ring from him, but I don't really care. I don't need his ring. You have to trigger that dialogue sequence, though, to, to advance the story. Our library is a man's har- Our rules are very strict. Uh, I don't think you can kill that guy. I think he's I think he's invincible from what I remember. Of course, you break the storyline if you could do it anyway. You've got to be thrown down here. Someone disturbs me. Well, let's go. Oh my god. Oh, okay. Greetings, young one. Alright. So, finally get to the catacombs. Necessary to beat the game. And the only way to get it get, get to here is to actually go through that whole sequence that I went through. Um... Some more spells that I guess I could sell. Protection from undead. But is there really any undead down here? I think there's a little bit of undead. A few undead. Now, you know, there's actually not that many undead in Baldur's Gate 1. Or at least not dangerous undead. Okay, so this is the library. Um, first things first, we're going to rest because we've got access to another you close your eye ability. Draw, draw upon holy might. And I'm actually going to need this to open a, um, a lock. So, uh, I believe so. Anyway, I've got the potion of cloud giant strength. And on top of that, I'm going to have to cast draw upon holy might to get 25 strength to bash open a lock. I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure. Oh, my two hit is minus... No, it's three. Wow, that's great. 
That's really great. Okay, um, yeah, so let's see here. What we want to do, we've also got our magic resistance, and do we need any other resistance? We, we could give ourselves 50% magic resistance with Potion of Magic Protection. Um, it used to be in Baldur's Gate 1 that magic resistance was actually a double-edged sword. It also would stop spells, good spells from being cast on you. I think they changed that, because in Baldur's Gate 2, magic resistance just... Uh, basically affects any bad spell being cast at you but in boulders gate one it used to be that it affects anything i don't know if the enhanced edition changed that i think they did but i'm going to cast the potion of magic protection on myself first of all because there's some nasty traps in here and well it doesn't affect haste so oh cool <laughs> yeah. hello there Okay, you... This is, this is where the game became kind of weird for me. I remember when I was playing this the first time. It's like all of a sudden you have... Everybody's a doppelganger. And it's it's bizarre. Uh, okay, so there's definitely a trap over here that's going to get me. Can I buff myself anymore? Or do I need... I no longer have any potions of crushing resistance... No, we're just going to... Let me see what my magic resistance... What does it say my magic resistance is, actually? Oh, it's 75%, so it stacks. That's pretty cool. Okay. That's that's really awesome. So I'm probably going to be almost totally immune to this. Okay, failed to open the trap. Okay, well, we're going to go ahead and... I guess we'll use the Potion of Cloud Giant Strength right now so we can open this trap. I'm going to save first. Okay, let's go ahead and open it. There it is. You have to open it because you got to get the item inside. And I resisted most of those. Ha! <laughs> Lightning didn't affect me because uh, I got magic resistance. That's awesome. Freaking awesome. There's another nasty trap here. Okay, not bad. And I'm going to have to kill these stupid spiders. Um, I'm not going to bother using the Arrows of Detonation, although it's kind of tempting. Well, maybe, you know what? Let's use a couple of Arrows of Detonation. Helps, helps a lot. Whoops! Hello! Thank God for magic resistance again. Alright, so he just teleported right in my face. So, we're going to stop that nonsense, because I don't want to shoot myself with that. Okay, and there's one of these traps over here, which I think uh, limits your movement. It's a paralyzed trap. Okay, well, maybe not. Okay, here's a fireball trap. Let me see if this... Okay, I can't I can't force the lock right now, but withdraw upon holy might. I now have 25 strength, and I can now force the lock. There we go. This gives me another trap. I'll take that. And magic resistance right out of it. Okay, so... Oh, that one hurt. That one got me. That one got me. Okay, here's the here's the trap I was worried about. There's the... Um, it's a web trap, but I don't have to worry about that because I'm using the, um, the sword that basically makes it so you can't be webbed. Spider's Bane. I, I don't think you can import that into Baller's Gate 2, so... It would actually be kind of nice if you could. Um, and then there's this guy who's another doppelganger. Die. These guys want to talk to me, but I don't care. I don't know what these guys are doing down here. It, it's it's all kind of weird how things work out like in this area because. I thought they were double gangers, but apparently they're not, which is like, what? You can just run past these guys. I'm going to kill them, though, just because I feel like it. Does he have anything? Nope. Totally useless killing this guy. He has nothing. Okay, so we're just going to run. guys are probably going to follow me if I don't kill him. So, 
Make sure they die. Oh, what? Jeez. There we go. Okay, now this part is a huge party of people, and I like to use the arrows of detonation because those usually uh, take care of them right quick. Any of your business? Not out of my way. I'm just going to target this guy. Oh, I can't believe this guy followed me in here. Okay, well, I no longer need to uh, cast the arrows of detonation. That'll do it just fine. Oh, he tried to lighten me, but um, too bad for him. I'm, I have magic resistance. This guy's dead. Okay, cool. Okay, this is a nice axe, actually. I think the first throwing axe in the game that's magical, I think. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Got too many items. I'm gonna fill up our spell book again. And this guy's got some some note there that explains that he's been hired to kill me, but it doesn't matter. Not worth bothering about. I think that's a diamond, yeah. It's a diamond. I think that's it's an emerald? So it's worth something. Uh, oh, he's got some interesting stuff. What is this? Wraith form. Okay, well, Wraith form is uh, kind of a rare spell. Haste. Takes you a while to get the haste spell in this game. I think you might actually have to get the Baldur's Gate before you can get it. Okay. And let's check the last guy, see if he's got any, anything with looting. Nope. Okay, so that was it. So, all right, let's quaff a potion. Uh, there's a few traps where you're going to probably run into some sword spiders. I'm going to quick save. Oh, yeah, I'm going to need the potion of mirroring eyes. I could, I, actually, I could sneak past these guys. So I don't really need it. So, you know what? Let's sneak past them because I don't need the experience either. You can kill these guys if you have the potion of mirroring eyes. But I don't need to do so. I'm, I'm moving a lot quicker. Oh, I know why. It's because that negates my haste. This, uh, the spider's bane negates haste. So that's why I was moving slower. Yeah. Okay, so life continues to All right, good. So, we've got our final ability now once we rest, another draw upon holy might. Which is pretty cool. So that's candle keep. We're out. We're in the clear now. Let's go back to the temple over here. Cuz we need to identify a bunch of items. Well, of course, Don't touch me. I'm super important. Spear tomb. Ring, cloak, manual. Throwing axe. Throwing axe plus two. Yeah. That's a good... That's like, I think, your first magical throwing axe that that um, does not get depleted, I think, in this game. Maybe. That's possibly not. So if you want to play a character with the throwing weapon, you have to wait kind of that long. Right. 
Also got the Ring of Fire Resistance Plus. That's pretty good. I'll, I'll put that on because uh, fire damage is very common in the first game. In the second game, too, actually. Uh, I'm going to use these. I'm going to have to sell some of this junk. I'm going to sell this junk. Sell most of this stuff right here. And I will have... Ooh, I'll have a lot of money. Well, of course. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Let's go to Baragost real quick. Done and done. Done and done. I can make whatever you wish for a wee little bit more than me competition. Um, yeah. Okay, this, 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 this. And that's it for now. I have 29,000. Um... We did not get the plus one to reputation. How am I gonna get? Some? Maybe I'll maybe I'll just skip it. I have enough money to buy everything I need anyway. Maybe we'll just skip the whole getting reputation to twenty. I think I just want to get done with the game. We've got Durlag's Tower. I don't think I need anything special to go over here. What does this guy have? You said something. Um, Dart of Stunning, nope. Does he have any interesting weapons? Oh, Bolt of Lightning. And they're pretty good price, too. Let's go ahead and... Uh... Yeah, let's buy some. Awesome. I l you never have enough of these, I think. What else do you got? You said something. Question of Master Thievery. No, I don't need that. Okay. So, we're going to go through this place really quick. And... Let's see. I'm going to probably just... Just avoid these horrors here, I think. Yeah, we're just going to run past the horrors. Because I don't need the experience for killing them, and they don't give anything. Pretty sure they don't give anything. I'm basically just here to get the book. I'm not even going to bother doing any quests or anything. There's nothing here that I can take to Baldur's Gate 2, except for that stat increase from the book. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, I'm trying to remember. Okay, yeah, you just go up here. There's a whole, like, thing you can do up here. But I don't care. I think that this is trapped. Yeah, there it is. There's the book. Getting out of here. Screw you. Yeah, there's like a set of quests over here, done but and, done. and I believe you can get well, some <laughs> yeah. some item. I think you task. can even get an item that you can take to Baldur's Gate too, but done it's not worth it. Done. It's no good. How the hell did I get in here? Well, of course. <laughs> yeah. There we go. Done and done. Okay, we're getting out. We're getting out of here. Done and done. All right, so that's that. And there's one more place I have to go for another book. I believe that's it, right? Yep, it's the Charisma book. Of course. <laughs> and although Charisma is not really important, um, really, I could have three Charisma and I'd be doing just fine. I'm going to do it anyway. There's also a few items over here that I can sell. Is it down? No, it's down. It's 
No, it's right here. Okay. Boy, it's been a while. Yeah, there's the bridge. I believe we just keep going down here, right? I don't remember this. Ha! Huh. Okay. Oh, okay, there's the other bridge. There's the annoying guy screaming at me. There it is, the Null Stronghold, finally. Well, maybe not. Not quite yet. There. There should have been a cutscene there, but there wasn't. I'm going to use that last potion of haste there. Me now, Mister. You go nowhere. This our bridge. You pay to walk it. Time for some carnage. Wow, one hit for that guy. Woo! One hit for that guy too. All right, that's uh, that's a, those are decent combos right there. See if I can hide in shadows. I can hide, probably hide in shadows over here, right? Come on. This looks shadowy. This looks like a shadow over here. Let me hide in shadows right here. There we go. Okay, good. Of course. <laughs> yeah. Okay, yes. And the rest of the stuff I'm not even going to bother with. There's my next book. Let's get out of here. Let's go. Let's hope the pathfinding <laughs> yeah. algorithm is correct. And uh, Yeah. Okay, that's pretty good. It's like we're making it. Um, this is where you're supposed to rescue Dinah here, but I don't even bother with that because I don't bother with Minsk anymore. All right, so back to back to Baldur's Gate. Oh wait a minute, let's go to High Hedge first. I gotta buy something in High Hedge. This is the only item that I worry about importing into Baldur's Gate too. Everything else is not worth it in my opinion. Done and done. Of course, <laughs> yeah. Why do I live in such a pissant town? Let's go ahead and identify. I'm going to go ahead and use those tombs right now. Wisdom plus one and plus one to my charisma. So there's my stats that I'm going into Baldur's Gate 2 with. Not bad. Not bad. And these are the Brawling Hands Dexterity to 18. Why I can go ahead and sell those. Yeah. Okay, so here's what I want from this guy. And it's basically very simple. Uh, well, first of all, let me look through the rest of the stuff here. Potion of Magic Blocking. You need the level 5 spells 5 and below. No, I don't need that. Um, does he have another Potion of Magic? Um, let let's me ignore Magic. No, apparently not. Potion of Regeneration. Uh, I do need those. I'm going to buy all of them really quickly. Potion of Freedom. Nope. Uh, protection from cold acid electricity. Nope, I don't need that. Okay, burning hands. Nope, I don't need that. Okay, so the only other thing he's got is the Claw of Kazgaroth. Kaz Kazgaroth. Yeah, I pronounced that correctly. So it's actually, if you can stand the Constitution hit, it's actually not too bad because it can be used with magical stuff like uh, other magic rings and stuff like that. Um, it gives an armor class of plus one, plus four versus missile attacks. Um, the only thing it does bad is the minus four save versus death, but that's okay. Uh, it's it's basically um, like an extra ring on somebody who, who can withstand, like I said, the constitution hit. And there is a character that, that can stand that. 
Um, the other thing is a Horn of Kazgaroth, but that's kind of crappy. It, it looks amazing in this game, but it's really crappy in Baldur's Gate 2. So anyway, so we get that just so we have it when we go and finish the game here and import. Done and done. And that's basically all we need. The rest is stuff to get ready for the last battle. So we're going back to Baldur's Gate 2. Or, it's, I'm sorry, Baldur's Gate. Task. And I want to avoid running into people and getting thrown in jail because I don't want to go through that whole sequence. Well, of course. <laughs> yeah. yes. All right. Now, we're going to buy the, the items that we're going to be using in the very last part of the game. Oh, wait. First, we got to kill somebody. You know who that is. You know who that is, bro. Um, but we got to buy some buff stuff first. Potion of invulnerability. Um, I'll buy one of those. Potion of absorption. I'll definitely buy one. Potion of agility. No. Potion of defense. Uh, no potion of clarity. No, 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 no. Potion of fire breath. No. Potion of genius. Nope. Potion of magic protection. I'll buy one again. Potion of magic shielding. No. Potion of mind focusing. We'll buy all three. Potion of mirroring eyes. Potion of Subception, Perception, Regeneration, Stone Form. No, I need the potion that lowers your Thaco. Where is that? Hmm. Maybe I'm in the wrong shop. Where is the potion that lowers your Thaco? Don't know. That's a good question. It's not here. Okay, so we need to go to the other shop where I'm pretty sure we have that. Um, see here. Anything else I need here? Oh, we need another. <laughs> yeah, we need to get some more, um, need to get some more haste potions. Done and done. But I know I can get, uh, I know I can get the potion that lowers your thego over here. Done and done. It's right, 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 right. Potion of power, but I can't use that. Thieves can. Oh wait a minute! Yes, I can. I can. Can I use that? I apparently I can. But didn't she has a oh potion of heroism? That's what I'm looking for. Okay. And the potion of power, that's a little excessive. I don't know if I want that right now. Um, in fact, I don't think I want it right now. So we've got to go... Okay, we've got to go to the temple because I've got to go get... Uh, um, I've got to go get some more potions of speed. I ran out. A simple task. There's a particular don't spot where you can get more potions of speed. And I didn't know about it for the longest time. In fact, it's kind of hidden. And they're very cheap, too. I think it's right. No, it's right here. Done and done. Can I get in over here? I can't get in over here. Really? Okay, we got to go to the front. I serve the flaming uh oh fist. uh oh flaming no we don't want to talk to that guy okay donation don't of one gold don't. and who the I hell serve the flaming fist okay I'm gonna be avoiding that guy don't bother these lots have always given me trouble trouble they are Okay. A simple task. Our guy's down here that sells the potions. Here he is. All right, good. 
Gon's greatest gift was the ability to invent. Yeah, here it is. Oil of speed. So he sells a ton of them. I'm gonna buy five. I don't need any more than that right now. Hello. Nice to make the acquaintance of such a cultured person. Yeah, go away, dude. Don't bother me. I'm busy. Okay, I'm gonna get the hell out of here, and we're going somewhere else because we got somebody oh, to kill. Task. We got somebody to kill. Oh yes. Oh yes, it's a ritual. I do this every game. Um, is it right here? Well, we'll find out. Is this it? Of course. <laughs> yeah. Let me see if this is it. This might be it. There we go. Hide in shadows really quick. Oh, this might not be it. Kind of doesn't look like it's it. Nah, this ain't it. There's no way this is it. And this is laggy as hell. My my game's lagging. Well, this is probably a good time to take a break anyway. So, uh, yeah, next video we're going to go kill Drizzt.